Good morning. How your baby daddy, your sister, and your cousin am doing? And your oh. Yeah. Football's happening over here, y'all. Fumble. <laughs> We're watching the Rams play what? Carolina. Carolina, whoever the motherfuckers are. And I'm over here editing the vlog. I'm a little tardy for the vlog, although it's up on time for y'all, but <clears throat> I'd have been had it edited and uploaded yesterday for it to release today. So a little tardy for the party, but it is going up. And hopefully you guys have some good feedback for me on it. If you guys have not already seen it, well, by the time you guys see this, you might have already seen it. It's the video regarding whether I should stay natural or text lax. So, yeah. I tried to explain it to Juice. He was like, huh? So, yeah. Even I'm still trying to huh. understand how it works. Huh. So, I mean, how that goes. Anyway. Big Head's over here. Bam. Hey, Big Head. What's up? About to drop the damn camera. What's going on? How are you? I'm chilling, man. I'm doing good. Eating my oatmeal, watching the Rams game. There's the Rams it's a little, game. It's a little bit late to be eating breakfast, but. It is late. It's 1230. I got to have it anyway. Mm-hmm. Man, look. Yeah. Just watching this Rams game right quick. Dude, this are you cold now still? I mean, yeah. I know you're eating oatmeal, but. Yeah. It's, it's, it's cold, yeah, y'all. That temperature didn't drop in St. Louis. I don't know what's going on, but. I got a bad feeling that we're going to have a cold winter this year. Let's not discuss. Yeah. I don't even want to talk about it. Y'all, it's fucking, it's like cray, 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 cold. Like, last night we went to, or yesterday we went to the pumpkin patch, which was so awesome. Juice had never been, you know, and, um, <clears throat> yeah, I wait, I wait till I become a grown complete, man. Complete, yeah, a complete a grown patch. ass adult <laughs> to go. But it was just, it was some, it was fun, and Pookie loved it, and, you know, um, even though Manushka told us last minute when she was heading down that way, because what I had texted her for originally was to see if we could take him to the um, pumpkin patch, because I didn't know if she was going to have to work. And then she was like, oh, I was going to take him, you know, to the pumpkin patch, so let's all go together. I was like, perfect. So, anyway, thankfully we were able to enjoy. The only thing we didn't get a chance to have was the funnel cake, which it's fine. I mean, I wasn't about to go pay five, ten dollars just to take a couple dollars out to get a funnel cake, you know what I mean? Had the most amazing food ever at 54th Street Grill, which y'all, it's just good. It's just really great comfort food. Is that the way you would describe it, Juice? Oh. 54th Street Grill? Yeah. Just good comfort food? Yeah. It's not like it's gourmet. There's nothing like extravagant about it at all. It gets very, 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 very busy on the weekends. Our wait was like 45 minutes, 40 to five to 50 minutes is what they said for our wait. So they make great margaritas. It's just really good comfort food. And our bill was so ridiculously inexpensive compared to when we typically go out to, you know, have drinks and eat and all that stuff. And we just oh. hung out there for a long ass time with um, Ed and Manish and Pookie. Hung out, Pookie Poo took over my damn camera and uh, we just chilled, so it was nice. Today is Sunday up in this B. Y'all know I don't say that with the Sunday, you know. And uh, today is essentially Sunday fun day. It was so cute. Juice was talking to Ed yesterday. I overheard him talking. <clears throat> and he was like, yeah. He was like, um, Ed was like, I don't know. if he, What did he ask? Did he ask what we were doing today? Or was it just no, in he general? He was going to hoop today. He said, uh, I told him to come along. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. And it was so cute because Juice was like, oh, well, you know, I would. But, you know, tomorrow's Sunday fun day. And, you know, what did you say? What did you say? It was so cute. You were like, the way he said it was adorable because the fact that he referred to it as Sunday Fun Day was absolutely adorable. He was just like, yeah, you know, Sandy and I have Sunday Fun Day. And so, you know, and he talked about, you know, the fact that we go to our little restaurant, you know, we have our little food and we chill. And anyway, it was so cute the way he said it. But he literally referred to it as, you know, well, tomorrow, you know, I, you know, we got Sunday Fun Day, you know, like it was like, we're going, we're going to a wedding. You know what I mean? It was adorable. Anyway. So I'm just editing and um, browsing fall fall gear. You guys know, trying to replenish some like things that I got rid of from a while back. Um, you know, like jackets and sweaters. I don't really own a lot of sweaters. Um, like the other day, the sweater that I had on me was um, actually that was purchased um, almost. That was purchased a year ago. It was purchased a year ago, but I probably only own maybe maybe four or five sweaters for real the other sweaters that i have i mean when i say four or five sweaters newer sweaters that are like from the last year or two all my other sweaters that i have i only have a few 
I've had for years. I really don't buy a lot of super duper casual clothes. I either buy or look out for really, really like flashy going out clothes. Like it's either going out clothes or like, you know, dresses and like, you know, that type of stuff. Or it's, um, it's pretty much that. That's always what I look for. It's I really don't look for much of anything else. I don't really go looking for cat. Like I don't do the whole like let me get me a tank top, let me get me a you know I just you know I don't buy basics. I barely ever buy basics. You will never really ever see me do that. So that's what I told myself. I was like I really need to buy more basics because they go with other things. They can be layered. I just don't buy basics at all. So when you guys hear me say well I don't even know what the hell to wear is because. I don't have a lot of basics. I have a lot of like fits. Does that make sense? I have fits. So whenever I'm looking for clothes, I'm looking for fits. Oh. Those are the things that catch my eye. Fits, dresses, stuff that if you wear it once or you wear it again, like everybody knows you done worn it already. You know what I'm saying? It's not something that you can like switch it up very much to make it look different like a basic would. So anyway, so that's what I'm doing is trying to get more basics. And then I do need some sweaters gradually. I need sweaters because y'all ridiculous 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 how cold it's gotten last night shivering while we were yeah. sleeping because we haven't turned on the and heat what i, I want to do is uh oh he, well, he's gonna give you some plans y'all we're trying to do the responsible thing oh, and not just turn our heat on right away right we really gotta we really gotta have a guy come out and clean the furnace make sure it's operating properly and yeah you know, clean the coils and all that good stuff check the you know mm. Check everything out before we turn it on because we don't want to turn them off on and whew, Right now we got to replace the whole furnace. So mm -hmm. We're gonna get this guy to come out here and clean this shit Before we turn this shit on so Until then just gotta, I'm not ready for that high-ass gas yeah, bill. We, we gotta, already got we a high-ass electric bill. Yeah, that's <laughs> You just gotta that tough shit. it out. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And, been uh, eating her ramen noodles this morning. Yeah, I needed and, some uh, soup. I'm you guys some know oatmeal I'm and shit. Had some coffee, so we trying to stay warm the old-fashioned way. Man, for real. Like, I'm truly... Food and drinks. For real. I'll oh, probably, let me drink my coffee. I'll probably mess around and have some damn apple cider later on tonight, so... We'll see. Mm. But until then... What? He warmed that up for me, honey, when you were up there. <laughs> it's like the third time he's warming it up. No, for you. Oh damn. Come on, Juice! Oh, I thought you were going up there. No. Yeah. All right, I go warm it up. Thank you, honey bunny. I love you. I would do it for you. Y'all know I would do it for him. Yeah. Complaining ass. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So. So yeah, today Juice and I are gonna do um, our usual um, that we haven't actually done in a few weeks. It's been a few weeks since we've done Sunday Fun Day, like at our favorite restaurant, one of our favorite. It's not our favorite restaurant. It's our favorite Mexican restaurant. So. We're going to do that today. Juice is also going to go with me to the mall. <laughs> like I said, this Negro right here is going to go with this Negro right here to with me to the mall because I need to get a couple things from the mall, not clothing. I literally need to make a stop to Sephora. Plus, he needs something from Sephora, too. So I need to, you know, we need to get that. Honey bunny, honey bunches of oats. Y'all know, still have this thing, the chest thing. Not as much um, stuff down there. Taking the Mucinex, and um, just, just, just sometimes you'll catch me with something in my mouth. It's either a mint, because I just happen to have it in my purse, or most of the time it's a cough drop. I actually like Hall's cough drops. I actually will suck on them periodically just to do that, because I like them, which is so weird. Um, but especially when, like right now, it helps soothe so I don't cough. Lately, the last three days, I've been doing so much laughing and talking with friends that, or with Juice, with Pookie Poo, we were laughing and stuff, and Manush, that it's been irritating me, you know, so irritating my, you know, throat and your, stuff. Your, so. your coffee, my queen. <laughs> What'd you call me? I said your coffee, my queen. Oh, yes, yes. You better recognize, nigga. He know I'm sore as hell because Jessica beat the shit out of us yesterday. Yeah, he's sore. He's acting like a Man. little fucking ass bitch. Yeah. Acting like a little bitch. Anyway, so about to finish the coffee. Then um, probably shower. Seriously, it's cold. You see, I'm bundled up. I got this. This is like my little, y'all know. Y'all have seen this sweater forever. I love it. I got it for Forever 21 a long time ago. I used to wear it as a regular like sweater, cover up, whatever, cover all, whatever. Anyway, and then it became my house jacket somehow or another. Yeah. Um, 
by now, by the time you guys see this video, my video should be up on the hair so you guys can see like the actual hair, what it looked like, where I got it from, and all that stuff. So if I remember, I'll put the link in the description box. But if you haven't seen the wig review, then um, check out the vlog channel. I mean, vlog channel. Check out the beauty and fashion channel. And it'll be up there. That way you guys can see where I got it from, what the name of the wig is, and all that good stuff. I am actually really loving that wig. I'm not even going to fucking front. This shit's bomb. Anyway, for me, it's been a nice change for me. And um, so, yeah, I am really excited that I actually, you know, got sent that perfect timing. It was perfect timing. Um, trying to debate on... And Miss Chantel, I have not forgotten about you. I actually need to respond back to you as well. Um, in response to what hair I'm gonna um, go for next as far as my next install. Juice is not a fan of the curly textures. Y'all know I always mention what he does not like. But I do what I want. Y'all know for the most part. <laughs> and I accommodate when necessary. You know what I mean? So, uh, you know, sometimes I'll be like, oh, I just feel like making Juice happy. Sometimes I'm like, fuck that nigga. <laughs> <laughs> y'all know, y'all married, y'all know what I mean. <laughs> so, anyway, hold on one second, I gotta check one thing. Okay, just gonna make sure. Anyway, <laughs> anyway, but no, for real, for real. Still trying to figure it out. I'm excited to review her hair, so, and I love doing stuff like that, like supporting, especially women in business and stuff. I love that, so, happy to do it. So I'm um, going to figure that out and send her a response email back to figure out whether I'm going to do the curly or not. Because if I install it, it means it's going to be in my head throughout the holidays. And I don't know if I want to do curly hair during Christmas. Anyway, y'all know that. I'm, I'm weird, I think, like in advance like that. But that being said, um, in a little bit here, I'm going to get up. So it's this black ass nigga over here. You know, don't let him tell you otherwise. We're going to them all, damn it. So we're gonna get dressed, go to the mall before we get hungry again, because he just ate, I just ate, and um, you guys can see my voice is still kind of. I think I'll start getting better starting this week just because Juice won't be around as much, and I'll be able to focus just on editing and doing that thing, and I won't do as much talking until I go to the station, because I have to be at the station next week, so we'll see. Whatever. I give up. Anyway. Juice, we gotta get ready, honey bunny. Yeah, after the game. When's the game over, huh? In about two hours. Nigga, we are not going in two hours. Yeah, we ain't. I'm going in two hours. What about you? No, nah, we going right. after we get our quick showers and get dressed. Yeah, after the game goes off. This motherfucker right here. Everything closes early, honey, today. And we have three... Well, the game, uh, the we game, have two stops to make. The game will be done at least two hours before everything We closes. have two stops to make. Don't play with me. Trust me, the game will be finished at least... I'm not Two hours look, before everything See, look, we're gonna get this together. We're gonna get it all. I'll let you know what ends up happening. Nigga. You let them know. <laughs> this nigga about to get his ass beat. All right, we'll see y'all in a little bit. Yeah. So as you guys already should have known, our black asses, that would be asses plural, that would be Big Head as well as his wifey are heading out to the Galleria. As I had said earlier, let me turn down the Randy on. Um, I remember specifically you had said you weren't gonna go. No, I I remember me saying I wasn't gonna go into the Rams game was over with. Motherfucker. And as I look at the clock right now, that motherfucker say four oh eight. So whatever, whatever, Negro. Technically, we didn't go until after the Rams game was over with. Uh huh. So I did what I said I was gonna, I was gonna do. Uh-huh. Not what you said you was, we was gonna do. Whatever. Cause you were animated about it. I ain't gonna go to no mall. You know what? I just remember something. Oh God. Hold up. On another note, I think I forgot to tell everybody what the score was. Other oh my God, yes. I'm glad you remember, cause I would've forgotten. <laughs> Damn, my bad. Uh, Well, I don't know if y'all know, but as y'all can probably tell, we Ended up winning one game and losing one. Mm -hmm. uh, first game we won 21 to 10. We had yep. 21, of course, and they had 10. And then the second game, uh, we had one inning where we kind of lost, you know, focus. Man, that up, whole inning, you y'all fucked up. And gave up about 10 runs in one inning. So 
we ended yeah. up losing that game 21 to 14 so yeah there you have it and that's pretty much what happened that day yes and y'all yeah. played the same team yes yeah same team double header same night same cold ass night wasn't that crazy y'all yeah. i mean the first game it was like what i mean they had one inning just like the other inning in the second game where they had 10 runs straight up like it was just motherfuckers just coming across the plate yeah. they did the same thing on the second game but they let them other niggas have it so yeah. that's what you call you know <laughs> uh losing focus right that's, that's all that happened because y'all for real lost yeah. focus on that game i was like damn we made about uh nine errors in one inning and it scored yeah. 10 runs <laughs> For so real. We still got a, little kink, a few kinks to work out, but you know, we're getting better. Big time. And they're, I mean, they're hitting balls and da, da, da. they didn't have a good pitcher, and now they do. So that makes a huge, huge, huge difference. But uh, yeah, they won one, y'all. I mean, shit. I'm going to take the win. We can get it. You know what I'm saying? Hey, our record right now is four and two. Hey. Yeah, four and two right now. I'm proud. Very proud. So I mean, we're actually you know. tied for second place. Get it. If we can win this week's game, we should be in first. Bet. But we got to win every game, though. That's the hard part. Okay. Well, I don't know yeah. about all that. That's too soon. Might be a little bit too too much of a... Yeah. That's a lofty goal, but I must still pray. Do that. He got eight million games this week, too. I was like, yeah, so we're going to go to the gym here today. He got a million games and won this week. So we'll see how that all goes. Oh, my God. Before I forget. <clears throat> Wanted to show you guys another lippy, if you guys can see it. I don't even know if it's still on my lips. It's not as pigmented as NYX Miami Babe, which is what I always wear. But I do have another one that's in my hands right now, which is what I'm wearing right now. So it's kind of similar. It's just not as, it's just not as pigmented. You know what I'm saying? So, um, but it's nice and soft and comfy, cozy, and it's nice and neutral. It's really natural, good for my skin tone and a lot of skin tones because it's got. The pink to it this is what it looks like okay it's the Revlon super lustrous lip glosses and this is number 215 in supernatural I've been meaning to tell you all this for the longest time um, this is actually just a random find I was like oh let me get these I think they were I want to say they were limited edition out but I could very well be wrong I cannot remember but I remember I vlogged it when I got it and never showed you guys what it came out how it came out so anyway that's what it looks like on the lips very natural like i said just not as pigmented on the lips it's more sheer and has some slight pigmentation but you can tell it's got that natural tone to it so it's really nice so if you guys are having issues trying to find my Amy babe because a lot of you guys have been saying that you guys have been um this is an option that you can get just directly from the drugstore although i heard nyx is also in target in some targets it's not in our target yet that i know of but <clears throat> I haven't necessarily gone to look for it because I already bought my NYX Miami Babe online. You know what I mean? And if you're looking for NYX Miami Babe, get it online. And a few of you guys have said you guys have gotten it and love it. I'm telling y'all, it's, it's the lick. It's one of the best nude lip glosses that are out there. Very pigmented and it lasts on your lips forever. And I promise everywhere I go, what are you wearing? I'm like, NYX. People ask all the time. So. We're at the gal. I gotta get a couple things up in here. We ain't doing no shopping, shopping, but do gotta get a do gotta do gotta get a couple things. Gotta get a couple things here. Juice need. Well, I'm getting something for Juice too um, that he needs. It's at the same place that I'm going. I'm going to Sephora, and I'm choosing to go out here because it depends. Sometimes when I come out to the Sephora, the um, color selection is actually decent because you know the gallery has a tendency to cater more to our people you know what I'm saying however I run into the issue of their of they being out of my color also because they cater to our people you know what I'm saying so I may have that problem today because it's a foundation that I'm wanting to try <coughs> that I'm going to pick up and um, you guys know my higher end foundation I've been rocking is the Lancome Lancome I, I like saying it correctly Lancome Tint Idol Tint Idol or however people say it typically but it's Tint Idol um, that's what I typically wear but I ran out ran completely out I'm using like the last bit of it and so I said when I go to get a newer higher end foundation I'm gonna try this other one that I've been wanting to try so that's what we're gonna get at Sephora if they have it I'm hoping they do in my color and I want to swatch it I don't want to get it online otherwise it may not work so yeah and then we're gonna go do Sunday fun day <laughs> Don't play with me. Don't play with me. 
Then we go. Mm, you done? Yeah. Let's roll. Alright. You. Yeah. Alright, y'all. So, um, up at H&M. I know this is not where we said we were going to be. However, they have a great sale here. Like, some of their sweaters are like, buy one, get one free. Y'all know I need sweaters. I'm not... Not gonna, I'm not gonna torture juice. Don't let this be the reason you're buying it. It's, it's, it's logo. Hey, but it's buy one, get one free, y'all. On some sweaters. I mean, they're standard sweaters, like similar to what I'm wearing right now. I'm just wearing a cream sweater. That's cute. Anyway, we're just looking. I don't even know where the men's section is. I don't have one. No, oh, they do. Form. Yeah. Small yeah, this form. is a small, yeah. It's smaller on with this mall for some reason. Probably because of the demographic, honestly. Anyway, they've got some cute stuff, like just some knits and, and stuff. So, thought I'd look, take a gander, why not? And, you know, none of this denim's gonna fit my husband because of his booty. They have like scarves and stuff, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah, pretty much the same basic stuff. Basics, you know. Yeah. H&M, you gotta just, you gotta put together. For men, I mean, cause Juice doesn't have that build that H&M carries. <laughs> Not me. <laughs> Look at that big booty, y'all. Oh. The booty. Is that the booty? That's just my leg. They're just, they're just that big? Yeah. The booty. His booty protrudes, it's quite funny. <laughs> Don't believe that. See, would, that's me. Look. Oh, yeah. Yeah, can, we, can we look at it? Okay. I just eyed something. Hold on. See, I would wear that. Oh, that's not a one piece. I thought it was. So I would do that. I would do that whole time. Yeah, we can go ahead and look at it. What's it? Looks good. <laughs> real good. It looks real good, huh? Well. Gotta go. <laughs> <laughs> hate him. Oh, he's so garbage. Okay, we're going. We're going. Anyway, they have, I won't get one free sweaters, y'all. Look. This bitch may have to come back here this week just to pick up a few sweaters to wear. You know. You think? Just to have a couple sweaters? Sure. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just to have a couple sweaters to throw on with some jeans like I always wear during the fall and the winter. I really do. That's all I rock. That's cute, too. Hey. Alright. I come back so low, do low. I told him I wouldn't torture him too much. Yeah, please don't do that. Right. Go back down this way, won't you? Yeah. Yeah. Damn, y'all. I don't That's know what this over is. Here. <laughs> That's some rice over there. Right. Okay. Let's be real. <laughs> some some weiss, some uh, feis, not ice. That that weiss, my nigga. It's a big, it's a big ass watch. You don't get in trouble for shooting somebody's case. They're gonna be like, get the fuck away from here. That's Super Mario down there. Super Mario. Oh, that's weird looking. Look at that. Mario, right there. Mhm. Mm well, I'm hungry, honey. Let's get a snack. Bit. Yeah, we're gonna get a snack real quick and then I'll be able to focus on Sephora. Yeah, let's get a snack first. Is that cool? Okay. Yeah. All right, so we got the wifey and Sephora still. <laughs> and uh, she's over here dropping shit. You're gonna make me drop yeah. everything. She's over here dropping shit. You're gonna make me drop everything. Sampling shit. Hey, you gotta do that sometimes. It yeah, be like that sometimes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go, there Jeez. we go. I got my shade. Go ahead and get it. Oh, by the way, this is what I came here to get. Best this stuff, stuff ever. Right yeah. I'm you see, for me, it helps with razor bumps, ingrown hairs, and razor burn. So, for me, I can't complain. And uh, if she hurries up, we can get out of here and get some food. Yeah, I am hungry. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie to you. We've been chitting, chatting. We've been running into people today. This is good. Yeah. I don't know why anybody Yeah, so if she can hurry it up, we can get out of here and cast the food in time. Oh, for real? Yeah, the Mexican food is calling us. It is? 
Yeah, it's called Mexican food. You sure Cheesecake Factory? Mmm. Mexican food. Dang. Yeah. Anybody mess with Cheesecake Factory today? Cheesecake. This cheesecake is, ooh, that just sounds delicious, doesn't it? Doesn't it sound yummy? It sounds great. But Mexican is on the mind, huh? Yeah. Sounds a lot better than being up in yeah. this motherfucker. You know what? <laughs> this should be the light of your life. Okay? Because you're with me. Yeah. Hey, so right now we're trying to figure out if we can get this family friends discount up in this motherfucker because it's just getting ridiculous. Yeah. You get that family and friends discount? <laughs> yeah, finally. I've been like, oh, why did I get it? Everyone yeah. else got it. How much off? Yeah, I'm a beauty blogger. How much off so, is that? Okay. Huh? How much 20, off? Thank God. 20? Yeah. You don't have one from 40? <laughs> what was that again? What was that? You said what? Dang <laughs> no, you won't. <laughs> Okay, y'all, so we had to stop by our favorite Mexican spot and uh, eat some food and grab some agave margaritas. And uh, yeah, it's not finishing up. We're gonna try to make it to the crib and watch some Breaking Bad again. Uh, I think right now we're on season two, episode two. Why are you, why are you and, talking uh, so slow? We gotta, we gotta keep it moving. Why are your eyes so heavy? My eyes are not heavy. Yes, they are. <laughs> Hey y'all, let me show y'all what's... I, my eyes are not heavy like his. His look like sleepy, like you look like sleepy brown. Sleepy brown, brown? really? I can't wait, I can't wait. I, you remember that song? No, I don't remember. Wait, I, I don't remember wait. shit. <laughs> <laughs> you don't remember that song? No, I don't remember that damn song. That was my damn song. Yeah, that's good, yeah. Yeah. This is why, see? We had some of those. Well, he had. I didn't have any, but he did. You're not gonna say nothing. Yeah. So we celebrating life. I had about four margaritas. You didn't have four. Did yeah, you? four, four and a half. I drank a, you know, a little bit of yours too. Wait, wait, wait. So How she couldn't finish hers. So I had a little bit of hers also. Huh? You had four. Four and a half. No way. No way. I think it's like two. Oh, come on. Yeah. Really? Hold on. Let me hold on. They, they charge for five margaritas. So I, had I had two. Three and a half. You had three. My bad, I had three and a half. <laughs> I don't know where that other one came from. But either way, hey, we celebrating life. Happy to be alive. Happy to be here today. But I'm getting ready to go home and watch some Breaking Bad. We ain't gonna watch them damn Breaking Bad. Shit, hell if we ain't. Hookah. I have hookah at home. We got the portable hookahs. They're portable or something. My sister loves them. The vapor and stuff. I didn't know. Yeah, the, it's like it's like water vapor. Oh, whatever the fuck. Anyway, it's relaxing as hell. And they're portable. They're little portable hookah. It's cool. Yeah, so, we'll, we'll show y'all some of those when we get back to the crib. Yeah. We'll, we'll give y'all a little sneak peek into you know oh my God. what we got last night. So. <laughs> Anyway, we're supposed to be watching Breaking Bad. First thing I want to watch, I want to start watching Scandal because I don't know. Breaking Bad initially, we're only in season. <laughs> Did you just like really go like? Did you really do that? Huh? No. Look at him, look at him, look at him. It wasn't me. That wasn't you? <laughs> anyway, so you're so stupid. Oh my God, you're like the guy on Martin. You're talking yeah. about uh, some of us. Yeah, uh, put, the ahead, put the dog. Put the dog. Y'all know what episode? If y'all are avid Martin watchers, y'all know there's an episode. Oh goodness! Oh, for you, for you. Thank you. You guys remember? Yo Yo, I am Jo Yo. What's up, man? Say what's up. Waiter of all time, he's always here for us. Well, I love this girl and I love her. Uh, is it your Yay! husband? Are you guys married? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Your husband? Yeah. We're here like all the damn time. Yeah, yeah they are. But we haven't been here in a few weeks. They've been gone for like a three weeks. Yeah, it's been exactly yeah. three weeks. Yeah, it's been like three or four weeks. They have new so. uniforms now and they painted the place. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so yes, yeah, so we missed a whole bunch while we were away. But we yeah. were away. I don't know why we were away. Why were we away? I don't know. Shit. Yeah. Probably too busy doing this. <laughs> <laughs> why didn't we get another agave margarita? I hate you right now. <laughs> 
Why did we not get another agave margarita? You drank the rest of mine. I wanted one. We can get one to go. Gotta go, y'all. <laughs> oh, I can't take my husband. <laughs> Hey y'all, we gotta go, man. It's time to watch some Breaking Bad. We done with all the margaritas. Can I have a margarita, please? You drink mine. Hell no, you can't handle damn margarita. Why? Because I said so. Look, motherfucker, <laughs> I need... Okay, see, here's the thing. I would like to get another margarita because he drank my Yours? margarita. Yeah, That's I want fair. at least one more agave margarita. You'll help me drink it. She Just wants help me drink it. Just she wants one. it to go, though. She wants it to go? No, we can't. They don't do to go. We don't do to go. We really don't. <laughs> Oh, we don't uh, condone that enough. here, yeah. but I do want to have one, one more? and then oh. he'll drink Alright, we'll share it, yeah. Okay. Thank you. Oh, that's lovely. Yay, yeah, with sugar though, around the room. Yes. I'm so excited, because you drank mine. And then I'm going to go home and have hookah. Did I do like you? Nah. You look like the dude, what was his name? With the know. dog. Y'all remember, he came on Martin's mm. show when he had his little television show. Little variety show, and he was like, he was talking about the dog having a the dancing dog. Dis <laughs> he was talking about the dog having a domestic dispute. Remember, he was like, yeah, he had a little domestic dispute. Remember that? Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Hustle man, I think. That I was trying to remember. It's not yeah. Brum man. It's Hustle man. That's what I'm talking about. And he was all like, go ahead, go ahead. And the dog just stood there. And he was all like, <laughs> that's one of my absolute. <laughs> favorite episode yeah. of Martin. Actually, Jews likes it too. Because every time we watch the episode, I promise you, he will wait for that one part. And he don't even like watching repeats of Martin. That episode is his favorite because of that dog. And no, he was doing actually doing all dancing. The dog wasn't doing shit. That shit was Yeah. Uh, Alright, y'all. We're going to finish up this margarita. Make it back to the crib and watch them break it. We are not going to watch Breaking Bad. Watch. Back. We're going we're gonna to do all that in the next 15, 20 minutes. All right. Hold up. Bet. Can we talk about something? We were going to have a meeting. That was the whole point of this. Was the point of this this sit down today? We were gonna have a meeting. See, I have all of my stuff, my notebooks. I have my brainstorming notebook here, as well as my business notebook. You know that I write down all my little ideas, things like that. My iPad. He even brought. Hold up. This motherfucker brought loose leaf pieces of paper. This motherfucker brought like these are papers from the damn. Printer. We don't even have our printer doesn't work, but he took the printer paper out. That's we were gonna take it with him for the stupid meeting. And then I started to try to meet this motherfucker talking about can we table this till next week? Because <laughs> I'm like, what? How you table something and we ain't even done nothing yet? How you table something we ain't even had no meeting yet? On that note, y'all, meeting oh adjourned. Oh my god. <laughs> Gotta go. I hate you right now. <laughs> What's up, y'all? Back at the crib, and I thought I would do a quick outfit of the day since I haven't done one of these in a while. There is really nothing too serious about my outfit. By the way, a lot of you guys on Instagram were asking me where I got my fur vest from. If you guys have not seen it, check out yesterday's vlog. Um, we were at the pumpkin patch, and it came from Macy's. It is a Rachel Rachel Roy, and I got it, and was it was on sale. And I, as soon as I got it, like I promise you, every time I rock that thing, somebody asks where I got it from. So, so, so cute. If you haven't seen it, just check out yesterday's vlog. But anyway, I got it from Macy's. I know a lot of people were asking me that, and the name is, um, the brand is Rachel Rachel Roy. All right. This is so, so super duper casual, but here we go. So, your girl is, of course, you guys already know, rocking out her wig, because, you know, I'm in between styles right now. And uh, uh, she's rocking out her vest that she got from Forever 21. Doesn't match my jeans, but I just wanted to layer a little bit just so I didn't feel like kind of cold because I didn't know how cold it was going to get. It was cold yesterday. Not as bad today. Rocking a hat. I got this from Urban Outfitters a while back. I've had it for a while. These never go out of style. Of course, you guys already know about. Um, let's see. Earrings, Forever 21. They're always hoops. I don't know what my husband just did when he walked by, but whatever. Okay, this is also from Forever 21. I got it in Chicago um, at the Forever 21 out there because you guys know that particular... Um, Forever 21 that's on um, Michigan is way better than ones that we have out here in St. Louis. Yes, my nails need to be redone next week. Um, uh, Michael Kors watch. 
Hold on, I don't think you guys have really seen it up close. Kind of, sort of. Let's see if it focuses. We'll try. Sandy's a little tipsy from the food. There it is right there. And let's see if it focuses again. There we go. This this camera's bomb. I love it. Okay. Um, sweater, Forever 21. Just one of those plain old cream. It's like an off-white sweater. Really simple. One of those basics that I said I always need more of. These jeans I got from The Gap. These are like those curved jeans. I've had these jeans for years. Honestly, like probably... I've had these jeans at least... Girl, look, you're growing these new jeans because I don't really buy a lot of jeans. So, um, not a lot. And, yeah, so it's just a plain old pair of jeans, something that was comfortable. It's actually a size down than my normal size because you guys know I'm smaller than I used to be. So I'm really happy about that. Boots. We got these brown boots. These are, oh, shit, these are Steve Men's, but they are from Schumann. Got these. A little over a year ago but you guys know you can find riding boots pretty much anywhere I know I've seen them at Macy's similar pairs to this at Macy's but again this is something that I get asked about all the time as a zipper on the side and they the the um, the more worn that they are and the more in the elements they are the better they look which I love these are actually too big for me not too big these are ten and a half um, for some reason they came in that size let me see if it's focused yeah and then you guys already know about the lip gloss although it's worn off because I was drinking and uh, you guys know I don't have anything on my face. Although, a lot of today I had shit on my face, like random fuzz balls and shit, so I apologize for that, whatever. Saw a lot of your comments on the vlog related to my hair, um, text lasting or staying natural. Just, I'm, I, and I got tons of comments about it. A lot of people said stay natural. A lot of people said text lax. Um, I don't know, I'm still really debating um, I've managed to stay natural this long, so we're going to see. I think somebody commented some shit like, um, I don't know what the fuck it was. It was some comment like, girl, it's easy as fuck. You just curl your hair. I don't see why it, ta it takes you so long to flat iron your hair. If you stay natural, just flat iron your hair. It shouldn't take nothing but nothing to flat iron and curl your hair. Oh, it takes me time to do that shit because my hair does not respond well to heat. I've said it a million times over and I will continue to say it. It does not respond well to heat. So the more heat I put on my head, the more, um, the worse it gets. It's just how my hair is. Ain't nobody got the same hair as me. You know what I'm saying? My hair journey is different than everybody else's. My hair also very much reacts to the elements. So yeah, I got some comment. It was like, I don't know what the big damn deal is. Stay natural and it takes two seconds to flat iron and curl. It really doesn't take two seconds for me to flat iron and curl. I'm not a professional by any stretch, obviously. And um, my hair does not react to heat. It just doesn't, period. I don't care about stretching. I've done all that stuff. I just haven't shown it on YouTube. I've done a lot to my hair in the sense of trying things, heatless ways to straighten your hair and things like that. It just doesn't react very well to shit. But I am trying to educate myself more in my hair. So I don't want anybody to think I'm just text laxing because it's an easy way to do it or I'm just, just trying to figure out whether I'm going to stay natural or not because it's just easy. It's just... You know, I think a lot of us out there that have chosen to stay natural or to be natural have those those times where they hit a crossroads where they're like, oh, this, this, this texture is great and it helps keep your hair a little stronger, but sometimes you miss the straightness of the hair from being able to relax it. You guys know I relaxed for years before I went completely natural. So I think it's just something that we all, for the most part, go through. Not everybody does. There's some naturals out there that just stay natural and they're animate about it. I'm just not one of them niggas. I'm just going to be real. I'm one of them niggas that just, I, you know, I'm at a crossroads. I don't know what I'm going to do, but um, so far, I'm still natural. I'm not doing anything drastic just yet. How long have I been on the camera? You know my camera time's out in 10 minutes. Let me see what this Negro is doing. I don't know where Juice is. Juice, what are you doing? Getting Netflix mm. set up. Will you come on? This <laughs> would you, nigga. Would you come on and watch the show so we can <laughs> You gonna fall the fuck asleep. No, I ain't. That's just that margarita bullshit. got you all kinds of extra balls, though, my nigga. Like you quit bullshit and come on down there. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> I hate my husband. Come on, man. Let's <clears throat> <just, throat> watch this shit before, you know, it gets too late. And this shit starts all right, let me get in. let me get out of me, my damn clothes. He over here in a... Y'all, look. Hold on, hold on. I'm gonna show you real fast. Ready? Huh? Okay, I'm gonna show you. Stay, stay right where you're at. Stay right there. Hey, stay right there. Y'all see him? The fans covering. Is the fans covering your <laughs> underwear? <laughs> it looks strategically placed. Yeah. Y'all yeah. look. He's over here in a sweater. Look, look. <laughs>